Mr. Prime Minister, we are very much obliged that you spent time for us, for Latvian State Television and our viewers. And we know that the election time is in Georgia and already at the end of next month there will be very decisive elections in Georgia. Mr. Prime Minister, do you consider that the steps which have been made recently would ensure an equal, competitive and fair elections? For instance, amendments won't allow for the use of administrative resources for political purposes. Would these elections be easily controllable? چه می‌آذیت از آرچن نویک نبا؟ کی پیروزی اروپایی آری کنم گان سوی اروپایی سگان تا چون غلبه سوگه تیرتا می‌ساتیس. تو بی نبود کار دساو بری سایس رو مارسیت که این داد سعی کنم گام مکانی بول ساخته است پر رسوس بی اصلا چون مدام وام بود چون گاکس کوری مقاله تیمی سرهم چون وارپی کرد چیش مالی داد دموکراتی ولت چهار تارو کار داد چه سال نسکاو سیکیت خودی. آنیس مقاله تیمی سرهم چون مکانی داد ما. خواهید که این استیس پست سیتون سمت شیر رو در چین رو بولم ده هر چی نبیس تا تو گنی بود که این بولو در اندیلی که دستگاه تلویزیون تلویزیون میذه خیلی داو خوبه سال کوتی برام مرا ویسکی خوبی آره ویدرا ساکت من کنده و خوبی برام کانونیت تلویزیون کنی بوده تا که دیو دیوی سوام میتونی. Well, these elections will be truly democratic and truly Europe-like. I will conduct it in a truly democratic way. Besides the talks and rhetoric which we have said. Uh, we're gonna, uh, we already have two concrete facts, uh, uh, among others, uh, that the candidate uh, who was uh, uh, coming from the coalition, mm -hmm. uh, he has stepped down from the Minister of Education's post, although he could have been, uh, he could have remained up until, up until the elections. Uh, this proves that administrative resource was not used. And the second fact is that I have closed down uh, a television station owned by myself uh, in order for this not to be used as an administrative resource. So these two facts and uh, other facts also uh, are evident proof that we're not going to use... Uh, uh, really? Dem is a, yeah. Though I would say poor viewers who have liked this channel, perhaps. <laughs> but do you agree that this time uh, this election will take will take place between two equal political powers mainly, instead of between one strong party and frequented opposition as it was previously. Real world, I've seen it. 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 I've مزرابیس تا کوپیلی پارلمانی است اولی ماره. ایم ولاد زمیت از سعی دلیسی است میگویند که از ریالورات فینگا و میوریادی کلیس. ای کاری است ریالوری کنکورنسی. چونی کاندیدی چه میازدیت کنکورنسی کاری شده بیلو سال ترشی کاری مرچوس. We have a sharp and distinguished supremacy, political supremacy. Our candidate, who's a very good candidate. Um, through my analysis uh, and through uh, popularity which he has in people, uh, he's definitely a winner and he's going to win the elections. Uh, and uh, the second part is uh, other two main candidates, uh, number twos in the elections, basically it's going to be a competition between them. First is the UNM, uh, United Nations Movement's candidate, and the second one is uh, ex-chairman uh, uh, of the parliament. Uh, and it's going to be between them who's going to win. Uh, but uh, for the uh, victory in elections, definitely it's going to be our candidate. Prime Minister, is it true that after the amendments to constitution, the powers of the president may even be perhaps smaller than the powers of prime minister? Or, um, if not mistaken, you told in previous interview to my colleague that uh, you may still slightly perhaps stay, step back if at all, as regards the amount of these uh, new Prime Minister's powers. I September then that's why we are here. That's why we are here. That's why we are here. 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 چون اما سپس پرس داده بودند سپتا سپتامبر شیو که پارلمان دیگر نیکل از دا از چارگی اول به بیرون پریمیر سوند کنده سوکو مخصوصی لیکن. Starting this September, the Parliament will uh, uh, start reviewing uh, the uh, the lowering of uh, powers of the Prime Minister, which is in uh, excess right now. It is my personal initiative to reduce powers of the Prime Minister because mm -hmm. it was clearly designed by uh, 
Saakashvili uh, as a powerful position and is going to be redistributed so we're, we'll have a truly parliamentary uh, country uh, in order to have balance between the branches of the government and not have excessive uh, power given to the executive branch and to the prime minister. Um, do you agree with this, those people who are writing that in this campaign more attention is focused on people behind the main candidates than on the candidates of the parties? Or do you, you disagree with that? Uh, I know. Uh, no. Let's say frankly, more people are concentrated on you than on the candidate of uh, okay. the Dream of Georgia or and with the com competitors as well. Is it true or how to say about that? Ce tun candidati romelit cunudi? Cunii mukhridan aris samo kene bolu koalitsi sari salian sa interesu ce miazit kolla fiseba atsunda kondes kaz bezinets masaks charbat. Magram kene gitwa ce mirat shkes kasa gebi arom rat kondes ce mirole di dia da isro me masfar sucer ce ilba gadam tsuati kos misi zoli satvis. Tumsa gide mi meure fisari salian sa interesu candidati. Well, first and foremost is the fact that our candidate. Uh, has all of those necessary qualities in excessive amount which is required uh, for the president. Uh, he's a very good candidate, uh, but of course you have the fact uh, that, yes, uh, my uh, persona is uh, backing him up, uh, but he himself uh, is uh, also a successful uh, candidate. Uh, and uh, yes, there is this factor also. Last elections, uh, one of important topics was cohabitation with Russia. Good relations or the equality of relations. Uh, now we have heard shortly before your arrival to Latvia about the thoughts that Georgia may think about the joining um, some organizations which is led by Russia, so to say. Uh, what role would play the Russian factor this time, if any? Russi <laughs> Well, Russia is our big neighbor and relations with Russia are challenging. Uh, we have already advanced in certain areas like trade and commerce uh, and we're going to be very constructive in our future steps. But it's going to take some time. Uh, those things won't be resolved uh, overnight. Uh, and when it comes to the statement which, which I made regarding uh, the uh, organization which is led by Russia. Uh, it was distorted uh, by uh, certain uh, other political forces. Uh, and of course, we're not going to deviate from our declared political uh, agenda, which is Euro-Atlantic integration. Uh, and it's going to remain Georgia's main focus. Uh, thank you for this open answer, Mr. Prime Minister. One but the last question. The last yes. will be almost of the record, but this will be on the record. I'm looking in the paper because I don't want to disturb the name of Mr. Georgi Margalashvili. Um, uh, early May, Georgian Dream nominated him as the candidate. And you predicted two months ago that Mr. Margalashvili would win in the first round. Yeah. It was written in media. The second round of the presidential elections was predicted by the former parliamentary speaker Nino Burjanidze. Uh, who herself wants to become the president, as it is written. I don't know, of course. Uh, has your forecast changed between this time and oh. these months? Same thing. I can repeat now. Me pikro from Margola Shuli, Gai Marjus Pilo Saveturshi, Tamashi Me Ejuyaramaps, Es Zalian Didi Albatovit Outsebat Gai Marjus, Neoriad Gilisus, Ev Zolven, Ori Kandati, Sarsna Solven Mozrovis Kandati, just like I have stated, Georgi Margalashvili, the candidate uh, of our coalition uh, with a very high probability will win in the very first round uh, and he's going to be victorious in these elections, in these presidential elections. And as I've stated, uh, the, uh, the main challenge will be between uh, uh, Nino Burjanadze, who was the previous Speaker of the Parliament and United National Movement's candidate, uh, which will be uh, number two in these elections. 
thank you for the political part thank of you. the interview and my last personal curiosity yes. of the record. Uh, I know that you have been closely connected with pharmaceutical industry in some past. And one of the problems of today as um, reflected in media is the resistance of uh, mm, antibiotics. 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 Do you agree that this is important problem in the world and is it important also in Georgia, this resistance of antibiotics because of using too much antibiotics sometimes, okay. because of using uh, v um, uh, cattle uh, feeded by antibiotics, you know. Yeah, I know, I mean, I know, yeah. Uh, how is it uh, in general, do you cons agree that it is a problem of in global yes, importance is, yes. and how it is in Georgia? Certainly, antibiotics are very important in the world, but it's very important in the social media. Uh, I was living in France for uh, some time and I remember clearly uh, because of all of those social security oriented policies which France had, uh, it was free drugs which were given out and free health care and doctors were pres prescribing excessive amount of antibiotics and in some cases it might have counter effects and it's not good for your health. Uh, same situation in Georgia, we need to control and work in, uh, in this direction and uh, of course we need to take cautious steps in ensuring that the public health uh, stays in good, good shape. Mr. Prime Minister, it was a pleasure to see you here Me and too. to talk to you. Thank you. And thank you for all the answers you gave to all my questions and I wish you good success in elections. Thank you. Your party block and you thank yourself. You. And thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. And please give us back the microphone. Okay.